gear you just needed. We brought Chris Welpdale in, who's given us that quality on the right hand side. Um, and whilst you've got quality players like that, it can give you a little bit of an extra option. Um, we just felt if we could get him and, and get Ratey out wide, which we did, um, they caused them a lot of problems. And it was just a case of, you know, where we could get the right quality in the box, and you'd expect that from two players of that quality. So I thought it was a 4 4 2. We looked good, we looked strong, we looked organised. Um, and that's what we do. You know, we wanted to come here today. It's not really the pitch, isn't uh, what I call the greatest um, pitch to play on. As far as if you do want to get a lot of touches in midfield and you want to try and then get your maybe your wing backs out and, and get them a little bit higher up the pitch, I didn't think it was a day for that. So me and Nick just spoke and said, look, let's let's just go over a little bit more um, basics, if you like. I don't think you can complicate the system on 4 4 2. I think everybody, if you've got two out and out wingers, which Ray and, and Chrissy are, I think that give us a, a good platform. And then you had Jazzy and you had uh, Ando at fullback. So you know, naturally all around the pitch, everybody knew their jobs. And um, as I say, who says we may not stick with that for the minute. But um, today we said it was a you know, tough game away, but I'm really pleased to mainly get the three points because you need to get a win as quick as you can in this league. Um, and, you know, as I say, clean sheet and six goals. Any manager in the country would be happy with that. And looking ahead now, choose Monday rather, Dalic Hamlet, a team that's just come up. What do you expect from them? Uh, it'd be tough. Um, obviously, you know, they've always been thereabouts in the Ryman, so obviously they, they managed to achieve the promotion last season. Um, I believe the gaffer down there gets his teams, they'd be physical, they have a lot of pace, they work hard and they play the right way. So um, they've not probably been to Chelmsford too much, we've got to make it a real fortress there on Monday night. But I don't know how they got on stuff, they played Concord away, I believe. Yeah. I they lost 1-0 they lost 1-0 did they um, but that's no that's no thing because Concord are a good side so you know this is what this league is this year it's so tough that you know you, maybe last year if, if they'd have got beat at Concord you might have thought well they're not going to come as strong on the Monday but uh, Concord to me is probably as good as anything in this league at the minute so you have to respect that if they've only been beat um, that was at home was it 1-0 at home against Concord it's not a major a major uh, catastrophe and I should imagine they want to put that straight on Monday but you know we've got a great squad here and we're getting them back now and um, and I think once we do get them back there's a few that we left at home today Jordan is still not right um, so we left one or two at home and um, we've come away but come away and got a 3-0 win and, and six goals and a clean sheet uh, I want the same again on Monday if I can, uh, but we know that the opposition on Monday is going to be a lot stronger than the opposition today. What I did see second half was some really, really um, good football from Chelmsford and if we can get near their mites on Monday, there's no reason why we can't put Dulwich on the back foot. Uh, I'm sure they're going to be thinking it's going to be a tough one, it's new to them. Um, we've been a team that's been in this division for a long while and been knocking on the door in the last two seasons of promotion. Are we stronger this year? Yes, we are. Um, but we've got to keep producing that second half performance and, and some similar um, phases of the first half today. We've got to make sure we do that for 90 minutes on Monday if we're going to get a good result against Dulwich. But um, we've had some tough games. I mean, let's be honest, uh, Dartford away, don't matter who's in charge, always a tough venue to go to. And talk here at home, you know, um, full time, very good side. So, you know, this, this was our little bit of a chance today to get our foothold back into the league. and. And, and obviously score some goals and, and hopefully grab the three points which we did. Thanks, Rick.